Oh, goody. All right, what is up, everybody? Zombies here again, and today we've got some more mercenaries for you. So this is a deck I've played before, um, but we're doing things a little differently today. The games today are actually going to be from a co-op I was doing with Dallas over on his stream. If you don't know Dallas, he's another great member of the mercenaries community. Does quite a bit of streaming, really good player. He was actually the winner of the Mercenaries 1K Open event. Um, really great player, super nice guy. And uh, yeah, so we decided to do just a co-op on his stream a few nights ago. And I wanted to get those games up because there were some really good games with a really good comp. So we're just going to go over the comp really quick and then we'll get into the games. Um, basically, this is the... Belinda Varden Valera opener, where you have your Belinda with her uh, water elemental, Varden with the band of frost, and Valera with a natural smoke. A lot of times you're just trying to speed up that water elemental with your Valera to basically freeze your opponent and lock them out. Um, in the games here today, uh, you will notice that Varden is running the band of frost, but one thing we did kind of notice over time is one of the very strong things about this comp is the fact that you can uh, do a lot of different flexible openers. You do not have to open uh, these same three all the time. And it pays not to sometimes because sometimes you want a Ragnaros out there to deny freezes. Sometimes you want Localar to punish speed. So there are a lot of different openers you can do with this comp. And I believe there are quite a few different ones we end up seeing in the games here. Um, so one thing we did agree on is that Chilling Amulet is probably the better item if you're going to be swapping your openers a lot, which does seem to be worth doing in the current meta. But if you are opening with Belinda Vard and Valera, you probably want Band of Frost. Um, then for our last three units, we do have Ragnaros with Sulfurus to deny those freezes and keep him nice and healthy. Localar with Frigid Winds because... Local R is just nuts and is pretty much the one-stop shop for dealing with things like Valera and Sinestra. And Jaina just gives us a lot of flexibility with the Frost synergy. You know, we got four different Frost units in this comp between her, Local R, Belinda, and Varden. So really, really good. Um, just absolutely love all the flexible openers and uh, really feel this is definitely a top-tier comp in the current metagame. So we're going to get into some games here. But if you enjoy the Mercenaries content, do remember to like and subscribe. It really does do a whole ton to help out the channel and keep the Mercenaries videos coming. Also, I will have a link in the description over to Dallas's stream. Uh, he is from Australia, so sometimes uh, he streams pretty late for some of us uh, NA folks. But I highly recommend you go give his stream a follow and hang out uh, if you can catch him live because he is a great Merc streamer. So without further ado, let's get into the games. I haven't seen this play in ages. I think uh, signs ran into them. They were playing, I think they were playing what you're playing, I'm pretty sure. If I remember correctly. You know, I was talking to, oh yeah, I didn't uh, mention this, but Image was actually the original creator of this deck. Well, I've changed it. Oh, I was wondering, actually, yeah. who made it, so that's good to know. Yeah, well, he, he says it's his. Um, pretty sure Justin didn't do any playtesting himself, um, and he probably watched some uh, some assigned stream and saw, saw it there. Uh, Image said yeah, something the... really interesting. He said, like, against 2-2-2, two, mm -hmm. two, two, you should open Belinda Rag Val. Like Rag. I like that a lot, actually, in case it's uh, another Belinda opener. Pretty good. I mean, it's pretty uh, intimidating. Oh, are you. Oh. Me? Oh, but we, we have the freeze, which is good. Yeah. Yeah, but you don't, because do it's Ragnaros. Oh, yeah, we don't. You're right. 
Can we kill something? So that's uh, 20, 46, 66, 66, plus 18, 66 plus 18, 84, 94. We can kill something. We can kill that. All right. Yeah, I like going for the Geddon here. Shut down their AoE, makes it hard for them to kill your Ragnaros. And you want the Rag alive, presumably, for whatever they have in I the mean, back. This is the hard thing. So we can kill, right? But he's, mm -hmm. um, we are all going off before. Like, so he's going to get four times four, 16 damage per hit, 16 times five. That's a lot. Yeah. That's a ton. That's that's over 60 something damage. I, I can't do that, man. That's, that's fucked. Yeah. I think I like trying to play around it. No point in swinging with the elemental. You're just flipping on giving him damage. Yeah, I like, I like your line. That's a good hit. Alright, so... So now you should be able to snipe down... Well, is there any way you can snipe down Local R from here? Probably not without super effective damage. We could kill the get in. get in is probably just as bad. Like, it's doing a combo damage. Yeah. You know, AoE. Yeah, I like killing the, the get in definitely. Like... 20 into that and then just use that i think that's i'm pretty sure valera is gonna die uh i'm pretty sure the full board is wiped actually yeah i think your your board's gone so you might as well just go for as much damage as you can get oh that's a five. Oh no i'll go into stealth and then this will go off do you is it it might be worth do you think it's worth Belinda AoE? That's what I'm thinking, yeah. I think you should. She's gonna die anyway, might as well hit everything. Powers up the rag, too. It's gonna be 50-50 on who I hit with my, my Valda. Hit the right one. Oh wait, were they at the exact same health? Or why was it 50-50? Yeah, they were at the exact same. Ah, uh, okay, yeah. Yeah, Colin, we can't freeze because of uh, Ragnaros. Yeah, it's so funny how easy it is to forget about the Ragnaros. Signs did it, I did it earlier. It's, uh, <laughs> it's really easy to just like, oh, I'll just go for the freeze. <laughs> and it's like, nope. Well, the bright side is you can go slower here, right? Like, eh, eh, hmm. So you need to set up... Actually, you're going to have a huge snowball next turn. So you, I think you might as well just go for either skill one or skill two, and then you can snowball one hit Sinestra next turn. Because you'll have it scaled with all your frost skills. And they don't have a way they can kill your local R anytime soon. Oh, what did you use? Oh. Meteor? Yeah, that's fine. Yeah, you're in a good spot here. You didn't even have to. Actually, no, you do have to still uh, snowball, but your snowball just destroys him. <laughs> Hurt, destroys the sin. Oh my god, a Tavish. Yeah, you're in a great spot this game, <laughs> I think. Um, Tavish is a little scary, but 
I think you just ignore him for this turn and kill the Sinestra in the rag. Yeah, I am too. But I guess you do, you do have two blues. Study. The snuff doesn't go off. It doesn't. Right. It doesn't work even if you kill Rag. Yeah. If the snap kills him, nothing gets frozen. That's one way of looking at it. <laughs> Wait. Why why aren't you going don't you want to one hit the Sinestra though? Right? Because it's gonna heal. I'm hoping that this is just gonna kill it. Uh that's a pretty big risk if you ask me. Cause they get thir free thirty damage if it doesn't. We'll we'll get two times. I'll oh, we'll see what happens now. Alright. I don't think this was winning anyway. I don't know. Alright, you got lucky with it. It worked out. Yeah, see, you 100% can win from here. If you lose the RNG, you lose the <laughs> Streamer luck. Easy clap. Oh man, that was calculated. I'm telling you. <laughs> I'm, I'm freaking telling you. Like, cause, like, cause I knew he was going to use 2-2 two, two, two speed as skills, so I was going to get plus 80. I mean, the odds not weren't 80. terrible, right? It's not like yeah. it's not like it was terrible odds. I just, I like playing a little safer. But I don't, think, safer, but I, I don't I, think you're dude, necessarily I don't, wrong. I don't think that was, like, the right play because, I mean, if I went for that, that play, just, like, to attack the, the Sinestra with the snowball, I mean... Mm -hmm. The rag would have survived, and um, you know maybe I would have taken too much damage on my my other mercenaries. That's what I was thinking about. Possible. Like I needed sure. to I needed to burn him down anyway. I wonder if it's still good. I haven't seen a man player in like months. <laughs> Mole who still plays it, I think. That was his like main deck. He was our resident ma'am expert. Wait. This this guy had the the get in slot, right? Yeah, I think that was mysterious. I'm pretty sure. That's why they have so many blues. Get in lock. I mean, do we just answer him with the 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 frost lock instead? Might be worth trying. It's not really a point in getting that rag right away, right? Because you're not worried about him freezing you. Yeah, the new mercs do require some tech, but I mean... I'm happy they're options as opposed to the the Valera meta where the counter was run Valera and win your coin flips. It's a step in the right direction, but there's a long ways to go, in my opinion. I just don't like Valera off the bench with these heroes. Yeah, it's kind of she is awkward off the bench. I do agree with you. Maybe Belinda was better. Oh, wow. Okay. Oh, wow. They have Death Rattle. It's actually pretty good for you, though, because if they get a good freeze with the Death Rattle, you can just... If so, one of your things dies, you can just throw in a, a rag and insta-ditch the freeze, which is nice. Someone did that to me today. I think it was in King of the Hill. I think it was Image, actually. <laughs> I 
All right. See, that's a 50-50. Oh, no, it's not. No, it's not. Oh, yeah, yeah I like the water elemental. I still can't believe that, uh, that King Crush interaction the other night. <laughs> oh, yeah. Thanks, zombie. <laughs> Alright, you're... This is pretty good, right? Because you have a block and they don't. It is good. We learned about a new bug today, too, with block. Or I did, at least. What were you saying, though? What are you thinking? No, I'm wondering what he's going to do with his bottom. Yeah, they could. They got some options. It's got to either be slow or try and freeze something, though. Mm. There's some real mind games here, though. Yeah, I mean, there is just jump out of stealth. Oh, yeah, you can just, yeah. Uh, hmm. It's a little dangerous if Valyria sticks around, though. He's going to kill my, my Vada. Oh, no, it's going to go on me. Oh, Liebrunner stealth, interesting. Oh, water elemental. So they were playing around your Valyra going in there, I think. No, you'd still be faster. So the water elemental is kind of confusing to me, actually. Also, the elemental does not get sped up oh, by Phantom Knives. He's fan. Yeah, he's fan. That was a misplay. Oh, yeah, they didn't pop you. Oh. Wow. Dude, he... Misplayed. Yeah, you can just run away with this now. I just stay in stealth, I think. Is four. How much spell damage do you have? Two times. So six plus six is twelve. I'm good. Holy shit. Yeah, I think you're fine. Oh my god, you get the bonus damage. Shit, that's disgusting. Varden value. I need to milk this value because these guys are going to die soon. Oh, yeah. Well, you get at least two. Well, yeah. <laughs> Can't die if they scoop. <laughs> Books are really hard and they have no idea that it actually got nerfed a bit. And might yeah, be easier you got a now. Point. And the changes matter a ton for PvP, right? Like that, the Karen change, the. The Burkhan change, like these are things you kind of need to know if you want to play PvP correctly. No, you're right. They can do it. Uh, but hang on. But he I said, gotta reach out. I gotta reach out, man. Yeah, go for it. Yep, go uh, for it. Sorry, I missed your messages, uh, by the way. Uh, Colin, uh, Tarap, we haven't played for a while. What's the priority for the five new mercs? Uh, I would say Localar, um, Belinda. And Sinestra. Uh, I would pick uh, Local Up first and then Belinda. Uh, but that's just me. Uh, Tater said, just as in real life, nobody likes getting mail unless it's a gift or package they ordered. They should just delete that shit unless they're going <laughs> to hand out free shit. <laughs> Fair enough. Okay. Um, he's playing 2 2 2 now. Did he switch? Yeah, he switched. Oh no, this is mysterious. He was, he was running the Sinestra and the Tavish. I think we versed Damo last. No, no you played this Mysterious with, last. I think this is the guy with the um I think it's the mirror now. We'll see.
Oh, Jesus Christ. Super, super. Um, Whoa. Super, super counter what is here. This? <laughs> man, you gotta have balls of steel to lead with an Illidan in this meta. Nah, man. This is like just a complete counter comp. <laughs> yeah. Like, having but... the Grom there as well, just to counter the Valera. But he doesn't know you're gonna open this every time. Like, you got like three or four different openers in this comp. If you open a little differently, this is not nearly as good of a counter. Azura speed kills my um, thing. He pops my, my Jaina and then does like a some sort of double strike. I don't know. He's probably going to snipe Valera down and then... He could use the Illidan to get way big damage into Varden, pop your Jaina, and then just extra damage on Varden with the the. Uh, yeah, yeah. Basically, Grom. my my Valera's dead. Um, what do I want to do now? Uh, let's see. So he's got two blues on the bench. I got my only green is Belinda. Uh, I'll need to set up some snap plays. He doesn't have any other greens besides this. I can bring in a green after this. Uh, red. Sorry. Uh, I mean, he's got speed. Go for spell damage. He's gonna keep his speed anyway. Slow doesn't do anything. Plus thirty. Uh, you know what? I think it looks stupid, but it might be right. No, I think you're. I think you're fine. Like I, I think that's fine. Boom. Yep. Wait. Oh. oh. All right, Didn't that was that. not what I thought they would do. That's okay. What equipment is on Illidan? Good point. Raise a fist. Yeah, see, that's why I got thrown off. Okay. I, uh, I don't like Razor Fist on Illidan anymore. Um, I need to save my green. Yeah, it. yep. Gotta save the green. Yep. Uh, actually... Jaina on the in the middle was wrong. I should have put something else in the middle. This is probably going like this, and I don't think I need any extra damage, so I'm just gonna try and. No, I think I yeah, I think you're good. I think this makes sense. Yeah, I probably should have used the um, the I shouldn't have used the media. I should have Kalen. Yeah, should have used Die the. Insect. I was just playing really fast. <laughs> yeah. I do the same thing, man. <laughs> I need to like slow down my play sometimes. I play way too fast. That is annoying. I think it did. Since it showed up. Yeah, it showed up in the, the left hand turn thing, so it probably did cast. I think, yeah, you have it on the Jaina, and you can, uh, if you stack your fives, you can just freeze out their local art or their Varden, depending on what you want to do. So we have more fives than them, unless they go like, oh, I guess they could stack three fives too. Oh yeah, and they can't snap you, so you have rag, so yeah, you, you do the local R. Yeah, but won't your rag be alive, or will it be dead by then? Uh, it's okay, everyone forgets the rag, I, I do the same thing. He does so much, it's easy to forget. I'm jelly of that diamond rag, though, man. That's so fucking sweet. <laughs> it's one of my favorite diamonds. 
Yeah, that that worked out great. And now you can just roll them with your water elementals. <laughs> Bro, it's ridiculous how good Belinda's water elemental is. It's like actually kind of absurd. I did not think it would be that good. We freeze the the Varden, right? Because he's the only AoE they have. Oh, you can just freeze both of them. <laughs> yeah, no, they, they have a chance. Oh, so much for that. <laughs> Oh, wow. Oh, Rag was gone. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, you... Uh, you still get there, right? Yeah. Or... Uh-oh. When the... You can still... Wait, what's your... Oh, it's one... Is it one off? It's one off. Yeah, I guess. Yeah, you're fine. You still win. This made it a little scary. <laughs> yeah. Lunar New Year thing? But I could be wrong. Ah, uh, I see. I'll take any free stuff we can get. They switched again. Free reds. I think it's GVT. I don't know. GVT nature. <laughs> it could be. Yeah, I think you're right. Yep. He kills my Varden, right? 40. Oh, yeah. They gotta go for your Varden. I th actually, no. I mean, they might focus the local, all right? Like. 40. They can't kill it, though. They don't have enough, right? Uh, maybe. Hang on. 20, 40, 55, 78. Yeah, it doesn't. Oh, he went for the um, Banner Knight. Yeah, the slow. Mm -hmm. That's okay. That's heaps fine, actually. Um, so his three speed there. He's gonna slam this, and then he's gonna try and kill it with the uh, um, Valera. Valera, yeah. I'm actually thinking. Hmm. This is nine eighteen. 18 plus 30. Yeah. That's probably better. He'll, he'll be... Oh, he switched. It's alright. Yeah. Didn't think yeah, that's... That. That's fine. That's actually fantastic because they lose the Valera stealth. It's really mm -hmm. good for you. I think we send in... Belinda now maybe. It looks yeah. like they are rocking nature, right? So yeah. I I kinda like the Belinda, yeah. I like Belinda. Um Yeah, I can stack my fives. Hmm. Oh. 
across Localar bench. So like Jaina, Varden, Localar. Yeah, the mind games get real in some of these matchups. There's some very real mind games. I love that, though. That's what I loved about Pokemon competitive. This is not what I'm doing, by the way. I'm just thinking. Mm-hmm. Eighteen, thirteen. Wow. <laughs> yeah, you're in a great spot here. I don't see how they can come back from this. Okay, don't make the same mistake that we made last time. <laughs> yeah, don't, don't pop the bard in when you don't need to. <laughs> Just let him chill. Oh, it's local yeah, local R. All right, I was right. Um, yeah, just freeze the crap out of him. Uh, 8, 20, 40. That's 7, though. It's 7. It kills this. Uh, five. How much frost damage do you have right now? Hang on, man. Hang on. Frost weakness again. Wait. Yeah, we want to do the lower damage on that. Higher damage on that. Do this, do this. Wait, what's this? This is 18, we'll kill that. Ah, shit. You just freeze something, too. I don't want to do this AoE. Yeah. I mean, you're still fine, either way. Like, I don't know if there's even a possible line to lose here. <laughs> 96. That's wild. Alright, yeah, we're, we're good now. We're pretty good, Chief. Yeah. I mean, I think you could have made literally the worst play possible that turn, whatever it is, and you still would have won that game. <laughs> Maybe I'm exaggerating. I don't bit, know. I, I don't want to give you him any chance spot. to come back in. No, it's That's good to, to try and get the lines. 100% helps you learn. Yeah, because the, the one thing I was worried about was the same thing that happened last game, where I killed the Varden, yeah. he has spell damage, and it just wipes my board. You know? And you get frozen, too. But you had a rag That's on the bench still. Yeah, yeah and a rag. Do you still need to do the, fine. that thing where you have to like rub the mercenary? <laughs> You know, that was like, uh, he just put it to the left of the... Um, Wait, what are you talking mark. about? Didn't you remember, like, Team America? Uh, like, back when Mercenaries first came out, sometimes mm -hmm. uh, when people dropped Rag, it wouldn't clear the freeze. Uh, I think the trick was in the end, you just needed to drop Rag to the left of the Frozen Mercenary. But people had, like, this superstition where you sort of, you, you rub the, the, um, the Rag on the Frozen Mercenary. <laughs> Okay, you that's that's stupid. That was a bug. That was definitely a bug. That shouldn't work that way. <laughs> I mean, that's funny, but it should not work that way. Somebody remember that's... that. Okay, I'm so happy I got this new computer and don't have to worry about some of that stuff anymore because my old one was on its way out and it was having a hard time. Yeah, it must be so much better. 
It's night and day, man. Uh, I was always so afraid recording the podcast that it would just freeze up on me mid-show and we'd lose 30 minutes, an hour plus of recording. When the 50-50? Ah, son of a bitch. Come on. Yeah, this actually makes watching it way easier, too, <laughs> for me. <laughs> the game is now built. <laughs> Dallas is going to pray now. Rage. This this is just a hail mary. Sometimes you just gotta do it. Come on, you gotta is, let R and Jesus over? take the wheel. No. <laughs> Rather. Hot any whatever. The is thinking, what's Dallas gonna do? I bet he'll never predict this. Like there's no <laughs> way Dallas does this. I'm doing it for the streams, man. Oh, Huh. Yes, okay, good. Well, that went well. Well, I wanted to maybe I wanted to kill both. I think I yeah. lost damage. I could have hit Lyra one more time. Yeah, I'm you still want to kill it, right? Yeah, it was 20 one more. 22 on the oh wait no that was how i don't know i think it needed two hits to kill her i could be wrong though Ten. okay actually maybe the aoe is wrong It seems pretty good to me. <laughs> yeah, like you get there easily now. Local R and Cookie are neutered. You can murder. How big is your snowball? I mean, you could just freeze in snowball next turn, too. Or no, you just kill it with snowball this turn with the. The elemental. Yep. Easy clap. Mm, this seems pretty sweet. Hey, 10k. Nice. Yeah, I'm ending it. <laughs> <laughs> Good stuff, I man. To get the 10K. Oh, thanks for staying on stream the whole time. Made it a lot. Easier. Yeah, it, it's it's fun. I I want to do stuff like this more. I'm just should have just recorded just, this for the co-op. I mean, I could just download your VOD, and and I have it, right? True, true. It's your perspective, anyway. <laughs>